Hi everyone, I am Dr. Rahul Agarwal, Consultant Vascular and Endovascular Surgery, Care Hospitals, Hyderabad. Today we will speak about what is vascular surgery and what does a vascular surgeon do. Vascular surgery can be considered as an offshoot from the general surgery or a cardiac surgery. Most people think that vascular surgery deals with the surgery of the heart, but it's not just that. We deal with the blood vessels, the arteries and the veins. So it is like this. This is the heart. From the heart, the arteries come out. They give the blood to the entire body. They take it to the intestine, to the limbs, to the brain. And when the blood supply is given, from there the blood is taken back to the heart with the, from the veins. Whenever there is blockages in these arteries that comes out from the heart, supplies the body and takes it back. In those places are the sites where the vascular surgeon's roles come. So such blockages, if they happen, what happens? A patient, if he has a blockage in the limbs, he can present with pain, pain while doing any work or pain while walking. If they have a complete blockage, then what will happen? They can have gangrene in their limbs. Otherwise, if the blockage is short, then they can have only pain. So when these patients have blockages, they need treatment. The treatment can be in the form of either medical therapy with the help of drugs or many medicines. They can need a bypass or they might need to be stenting. So vascular surgery is a unique speciality which deals with the entire spectrum of treatment, the medical, the open bypasses or the stenting. In other words, this is the only speciality which can give a treatment for the arterial disease or the venous disease without any bias and selection or the artificial selection of any treatment. So I hope with this small video, I am able to create some awareness about the vascular surgery and what does a vascular surgeon do. Thank you.